What is a Nikon F Apollo? Hi, and welcome to Jules Voto's Photo Focus. In July of 1971, Apollo 15 was launched on a mission to the moon and a specially modified Nikon FTN camera with a 55 millimeter 1.2 Nikkor lens was on board in the command module. This camera had special lubricants to meet the demands of space travel, an enlarged film advance lever and shutter release so it could be operated by astronauts with gloves on. The self-timer was removed. Also, it had a new design focus screen called the Apollo, and the camera was painted matte black. There may have been other minor changes that I'm not aware of. In the fall of 1971, Nikon introduced the F2 with many improvements over the F, three of which were plastic tip film advance lever, a redesign self-timer lever, and a threaded PC connection for flash. Now in the spring of 1972, those three changes I just mentioned, self-timer lever, plastic film advance lever, tip on the film advance lever, and threaded PC outlet made their way into the Nikon F. Now the Nikon F was in production for another approximate 18 months. Production of the F ended in October of 1973. Now just one just quick note. Um, this threaded PC outlet might not seem like a major improvement, but if you ever had a PC cord fall out of your camera, uh, you will appreciate it. So you basically just put it in and you just screw it in. I, hope, I know it's hard to see what I'm doing here. Okay, and you screw it in, and then it's not going to pull out. Okay, it's not going to fall out. If it gets caught on something, it's, it's going to stay in place. Now here's an older F with before these changes were made, and that PC cord just can pull right out. If you catch it on something, uh, on your neck strap, on a, something else you're carrying, it easily pulls out. So, where does this Nikon Apollo come from? Okay, at some point, people started calling Nikon Fs with these changes, Nikon F Apollos, even though the real Nikon FTN command module camera did not look like the late model production F that we have here. Now, there's nothing wrong with calling that camera a Nikon F Apollo, but it's not. You will pay a premium for this model on the used market. I think it's better to call this camera a Nikon F with F2 Cosmetics, although the thread of PC outlet is not cosmetic, but a very real improvement as I just showed you. I think the plastic tip advanced lever is also a nice improvement. It's more comfortable than the old all metal one on the F. So if you're looking to buy an Nikon F, there's one other advantage to the late production model. The F first hit the market in 1959 and continued in production until the fall of 1973. So it's possible that the so-called Apollo version, the one you see here, could possibly be in better shape than a much older model. Oh, one other thing. The Apollo screen went into production and was later called the P screen and it was available for the Nikon F and F2, and also there was a version for the F3 and F4. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also, look in the description below for a link to my videos on the Nikon F and F2 and their meters and accessories. 
Remember, I publish a new video every Wednesday morning at 11 a.m. I'll talk to you next time.